This short guide will introduce you to the free reference management tool, Mendeley. Mendeley can be used to collect, save and organise your references, cite directly into your work and create ready formatted bibliographies. To get started, go to mendeley.com and select create an account. We recommend using your personal email address to ensure that you can access your research beyond your time with us at the University of Kent. Once you've created an account, you'll need to download the three key components of Mendeley. Scroll to the bottom of the screen to find the three downloads you'll need. Reference Manager is the library where your references are stored. Web Importer is a browser extension to collect online references on the go. And Citation Plugin connects your Mendeley library to any Word document, allowing you to insert references and bibliographies. Click into each of these three components to download. Once you've downloaded all three components, you can now access your Mendeley library. Any references you add to your library will appear here in the middle of the screen, and you can click on any title to get information about each resource, including links and PDFs if available. There are also options to annotate your references to add your own notes as you research. Use the options on the left side of the screen under Collections to organise your references in folders. You can create a new folder by typing in the New Collection field. Once created, you can then save references into your New Collections folder by dragging and dropping the reference from the main library. You can add references to your Mendeley library by importing online articles as RIS files, adding references manually, or using the Web Importer tool. For this example, I'm using an article found via an academic database from the library's digital resources. Click on the title of any article or electronic resource you'd like to add. From here, you are then looking for any option to export the file. You must select RIS file or RIS file from the list of options provided. This will appear on most academic databases as the default option. Then select Save. This allows you to save the RIS file to your device. Then in your Mendeley library, select Add New from the top left of the screen and select the file from your device. Select the RIS file downloaded and select Open. The reference is now stored in your Mendeley library and you can add this to a subfolder or a collection by dragging and dropping or alternatively scroll down and select organize and then select the collection to add to a specific folder. We can also add references manually to our libraries. Select add new from the top left of the screen and then select add entry manually. From here, you can then search by DOI or PubMed identifier to search, find and fill in the fields for you. Or you can complete each field yourself, scrolling down manually before selecting Add Entry. Lastly, you can also use Web Importer, one of the three components you downloaded in Step 2. Web Importer is a browser extension which sits at the top in your Extensions tab. Open any online resource and then select the Mendeley browser extension. Mendeley will then detect any metadata from that page and give you an option to save this reference to your Mendeley library. Or you can also save to a specific collection. Once selected, you can then select Add. You can view this reference then by selecting View Library to view this in your main Mendeley library and also in your selected collections folder. The final step in using Mendeley is the citation plugin, connecting your reference library to any Word document. Remember, you must make sure you are logged into your Mendeley library before using. Once you are logged in, open up any Word document and then from the top toolbar, select references. You will then see the Mendeley icon. Select Mendeley site to see your full Mendeley library. To get started, position your cursor wherever you want to insert your first citation. Once positioned, then select the relevant reference from your library. And then select Insert One Citation. 
the reference will appear in your chosen reference style within the main body of your text. Repeat this step as needed throughout your Word document. Then, when you are ready to add your completed reference list or bibliography, place your cursor at the very end of your text. Then select the three dots from your Mendeley library. And from here, select Insert Bibliography before continuing. Your formatted bibliography will now appear at the very end of your Word document. For further help and guidance, please see our Reference Management Tool Guide and contact the library team 